Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing the My Followers Choose My Nail Set Challenge thing. So basically, I put a whole bunch of polls up on my nail Instagram, and I'll put my nail Instagram on the page right here. I asked you guys a whole bunch of different questions, and based off the results, this is the set I came up with. So I'm just going to show you the process and everything. And also, I'm a beginner and I'm self-taught, so I know it's not the best, but it was just a fun little video to do because we're all bored in quarantine. So I started off by just prepping my nails, and I'm just using my electric nail drill to just buff out my nail bed. And then I'm using some cuticle bits to really clean up my cuticles and everything. And sorry if my hands look super grody, I just took my old set off and then I washed some dishes and cleaned my bathroom so my hands are super dry. So here I'm just taking this nail dehydrator and I'm putting it on my nails and then I'm also going to be taking this nail primer and putting that on top. So I lost the clip of me showing the tips and putting them on but I asked you guys what length I should do and long one by 80% thank god because I hate short nails and then I asked about the shape and coffin one by 73%. So here I'm just re-dehydrating and priming to prevent lifting. So then I ask you guys what color scheme I should do and pastels had the most votes. So I made these poly gels myself and these are the pastel colors I decided to use. And then I asked what design to do and marble had the most votes so I just pushed the poly gels together to kind of morph it into some marble effect. It kind of looked like tie-dye almost as well. I think it was really cute. So I just went ahead and did the full marble nails on those three fingers and then I asked how many accent fingers I should do and you guys said two. So for the middle two I just put the marble but only in the middle and then I did it at a diagonal and then did the other nail doing the diagonal the other way. I know that probably doesn't make sense. I'm like so bad at these voiceovers. I've like filmed this like 10 times but you can just um, watch the video and see what I did. So after I let it cure, I just got a file and defined the lines a little bit more. And so I asked you guys if I should add like any glitters, foils, um, chromes and all of that and you guys said yeah. So I got some gold foil and I put it on the diagonal lines on both nails.
So I'm just taking a clear poly gel to put on top to encapsulate the designs. So I do that to all the fingers. Actually, I do it on top of the full marble ones as well. So just when I'm filing, I don't accidentally file off some of the design. And so this is what the nails look like after application and then I went ahead off camera and filed them and this is what they look like and then I just cleaned them off with some rubbing alcohol. Then I asked you guys if I should use any decals and this one was 50-50 most of the day and then when I went to check it had yes. I was really hoping it would be a no because I felt like these nails didn't need the stickers. But I found these white flower ones and I wasn't really sure like where to place them so I tried like a lot of different options. And then I asked you guys if I should use rhinestones and you said yes. So I used the rhinestones and also these pearl ones as well. And honestly by here it was like 2am and I was so tired. So I kind of did a horrible job with the rhinestone placements. I personally probably wouldn't have added rhinestone to this set anyway. But yeah, I honestly don't even know what I was doing. But it's okay, I guess it kind of worked in the end. And then here I'm just taking my top coat and I'm putting top coat on all the nails and then for the clear ones I'm putting top coat underneath as well so that it really looks clear and transparent. And then I just finished it off with some cuticle oil and that was it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. This was my first video, so I'm sorry if it was not that good, but I definitely will improve and it was so much fun. I definitely will make more videos, so um, subscribe and I guess like and comment and I'll see you in my next video.